Hey guys, today I'm going to be talking on the definition of wealth. The definition of wealth is the number of days you can survive without physically working or anyone else in your household physically working and still maintain your standard of living. For example, if your monthly expenses are 5000 a month and you have 20000 in, in savings, your loss is approximately 4 months or 120 days. Wealth is measured in time, not dollars. By 1990, wait a minute. Okay, uh, Kim and Robert were wealthy, wealthy and indefinitely barring great economic changes because of the income from their investments was greater than their monthly expenses ultimately it's not how much money that matters but how much you keep but how much money you keep and how long that money works for you every day robert meets people meets many pe- meets many people who make a lot of money but all of their money goes down the expense column every time they make a little money they go shopping they often buy a bigger house or a new car which results in long term debt and more hard work nothing is left into the asset column the money goes out so fast that you think this is some kind of financial la- laxative laxative your cash flow pattern looks like this. So job goes into income, then it like swirls by past the expenses, then it swirls down into the liabilities, then to the expenses, then it goes out of here. Okay, um, let's read uh, also. So basically, I'm like, usually like people like, once, uh, once they like get rich and like once they have all that money, well then they'll just spend it on a bigger house or a new car or like, uh, you know, other stuff like with the latest phone like the iPhone 12, which probably everyone has. And, or would they rather, s- would you rather buy would you? No, let's just keep going on. Red line finances. In the world of cars, there's a saying about keeping the engine at the red line. Red line means the throttle is keeping the RPM of the engine close to the red line. The maximum speed the car's engine can maintain without blowing up. Many people, rich and poor, operate consistently at the financial red line of their personal finances. No matter how much money they make, they spend it as fast as it comes in. The trouble with operating your car's engine at the red line is that the life ex- expected, expecting <laughs> of the engine is shortened. The same is true true was operating finances at the red line several of robert's doctor friends say that one of the main problems they see today is is stress caused by working hard and never having enough money one says that the biggest cause of health disorders is something she calls cancer of the wallet so um So basically, so like, um, like, let's say someone gets like, um, like someone gets thirty dollars. Okay, you and like probably want to buy something. We say like something he really wanted, but he didn't have the money for it. Then he just straight up buy it. Yeah. So, um, that's what I see, but I don't really get it, but that's what I think I should say or something like that. But yeah, that's it. Like, and subscribe. Bye!